We've added new capabilities to ETAP 20.6, allowing you to ensure safety and maintain compliance. These include a public safety magnetic field exposure evaluation based on underground cables. You can reduce risk, improve safety, and enforce compliance based on new DC arc flash calculator based on German standard. And you can automate your sequence of operation studies for STAR and STAR-C based on the ETAP study wizards. ETAP 20.6 has also been enhanced, giving you more flexibility for your design and analysis with massive improvements to the AutoCAD DWG import and export capability, which we call XCAD. New plot analyzers for existing ETAP modules have also been added that allow you to perform graphical plot comparison. The ETAP API now allows for even better interoperability using the RESTful API. ETAP 20.6 continues its enhancements for renewable energy integration and grid compliance. At the forefront is ETAP grid code, which now allows for ENA, ER, G55 based harmonic grid code compliance. Transformer inrush allows for not only transformer inrush simulation, but is also capable of providing deliverables that are intended for grid code compliance. Solar PV estimation allows us to model any type of solar panel directly in ETAP, and we continue to improve and add new solar panels directly into the ETAP library. High fidelity simulation allows for better design flexibility. Plot view allows for flexible charting and live plotting now in many different ETAP modules. Scripting and automation through ETAP Pi has been expanded, allowing you to get, set, and even create or delete elements. Electromagnetic transients or EMT COSIM is now automated through the study wizards, allowing you to perform more simulations at a click of a button. Intelligent schematic builders and views have been expanded by integrating the UGS system with the cable magnetic field calculations. The one-line diagram has new capabilities for visualization and representation of the graphical results and information. The ETAP interface, of course, has multiple enhancements throughout the program. We have also enhanced the design speed and accuracy by improving NetPM, allowing you to synchronize project settings and composite network information. Data Exchange now has new conversion methods as well as improvements to legacy conversion tools. A new version of ETAP app now brings search and auto backup capability with an upcoming Android version. We have also enhanced our model-driven design and control solution, which is based on software and hardware. That includes the ETAP microgrid controller and energy management system, as well as the EPPC or power plant controller. Unified Power System Situational Intelligence is now further augmented by expansion to the ePROTECT relay adapters and improvements to the type of data that we exchange between ETAP and other assets. Operator Training Simulator has better interfaces and better visualization of the training simulation results. And we've expanded our visualization as well as the prediction of fault analysis and the fault location system.